A chance to etch your name in folklore. Who's it going to be? Only two teams left in the battle for the FA Cup. There can be just one winner. It's Manchester City, they face Manchester United, and it's live on EA TV. At long last, the wait is over. A warm welcome to Wembley. This is Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson, and we're approaching kickoff time in what promises to be a spectacular FA Cup final. It is Manchester City taking on Manchester United. Well, Derek, as a youngster growing up, this was the day that every young footballer dreamt of. Playing in the FA Cup final, walking out in front of 100,000 fans at Wembley, broadcast around the world, it still brings a tingle to my spine. And I'm really looking forward to this one. Well, they have it again. City could be onto something. Gives it a go! Well, unable to direct it on the target, and a goal kick to come. Scott McTominay. Rashford. Harry Maguire now. Given away by Manchester United. Could be dangerous. Well, it's always a great thrill to watch Erling Haaland in action. He can be absolutely unstoppable. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. One nil then. Foden. City move it forward with purpose. Foden. Very quick thinking there. Oh, nice ball over the top. Out of play for a Manchester City throw in. Diash. Akanji has it. Sloppy there, Bernardo Silva. Rashford. Teammates available. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Just wanted to get it out of there. Rashford. Rashford. Corner to United as they look to extend their lead. Trying to pick out a teammate. Oh, a disappointing clearance. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Just have to make sure they don't get caught on the counter-attack. This could level it. Oh, the equaliser! Just what they needed, and the dream remains very much alive. Well, here it is again, and you have to say the 1-2 completely opens up the defensive structure. And this is Haaland at his very best. He's composed, he shows great technique, and he just smashes it beyond the keeper. So, 
underway again here on the back of that leveller. Marcus Rashford. Well, let's see if something comes of this. Long way out this. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. <laughs> Trying to deliver it accurately. Not the result from the set piece they were looking for. Bruno Fernandes has it. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Oh, he'll take us on. Oh, it's in. They take the lead here. And just how important could that be in the grand scheme of things? So on with the match. 2-1 is the scoreline. What's going to happen next? Rashford. Rashford unable to hold it. Holland. And the referee's whistle, that will conclude the first half here at Wembley. And the ball moving again, advantage United, but plenty of time for a few twists and turns here. What a brilliant pass. Rashford! Oh, did so well to deny him. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, not away properly. And there it is! A two-goal cushion now. And just look at these fans. The trophy coming their way, surely. Well, let's look at this again. He judges the flight of the ball. He sets himself ready to strike it. And then he just hits it so sweetly. That's the perfect volley. Well, back to the drawing board, I'm afraid. His team have been really poor today. So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. Gvardiol. Manuel Akanji. It is advantage Manchester City here. Real chance. A goal! As they cut into their advantage, still plenty of life in this match. Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space, and it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. Well, you can see the frustration in his face. Eric Ten Hag's team have just switched off here. Well, the action underway again. Can City go hunting for an equaliser now? Well, that one has promise. And goes for goal! And the goalkeeper's touch, that was crucial. Corner kick to United, and an opportunity perhaps for them to make it look even better. 
delivering it and cleared away oh he's gone for goal really good piece of goalkeeping there corner given to United Who can he pick out? Well, trying something slightly unconventional, but not close to scoring. And Manchester City will go to their bench. Thirty minutes to go, then. That's a lovely ball. And City recovering possession well. De Bruyne. Teammate available. Oh, good save. Put in by De Bruyne. Well, able to survive that attacking push. Terrific block. Well, maybe a good position from which to counter. Firing it towards goal! Oh, good reflexes from the keeper and the danger averted. Well, good idea in terms of the shot, but not to be. Well, you tend to think Kevin De Bruyne dominates most matches, but he hasn't been dominant in this one, Stuart. Yeah, you're right. He needs to impose himself on this game. He just hasn't done enough to get away from his marker so far. Unless that changes, they're going to struggle to turn this one around. Manuel Akanji. Foden Rodri and the ball with De Bruyne and he's making progress takes aim oh he's blocked it says he need a boost will they get one from this corner and the short option preferred Grealish Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. They'll repeat the trick. Corner again. Short corner taken. Well, pressure building. Another corner. Kevin De Bruyne with the corner. And the keeper flings himself at the ball. Growing pressure here, and another corner. And De Bruyne firing it over. Oh, a very fine header, but it wouldn't go in for him. Well, behind for another corner. Not quite what they were working on in training this week. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. And he takes on the shot. Really close, sweeping attacking play. Well, they just couldn't finish off what would have been a great goal on the counter-attack. Five minutes remaining, and one thing is certain, no one is leaving because it's still close. Real chance. Going for the chip. Well, they're still trailing, and time is against them. Well, it was a big chance and a big miss. That should have been the equaliser. Not long left now. And take it away. He won the ball. Good idea. Oh, I can't believe it! Twists and turns in the closing stages. And it's anyone's guess who's going to lift the trophy. Incredible!
Well, here we can see it again, and it's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, and when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. United being afforded too much space. And they grab the lead late on. And just over the bar, albeit narrowly. Mateo Kovacic. The ball with Rodri. Good tackle, take it away. Oh, well, that one has promise. Oh, he fancies his chances. Manchester United know they've got to be precise with the corner, given the circumstances. Well, that's it for the 90 minutes, but this is not over, and two 15-minute periods of extra time to come. Number eight, Mateo Kovacic. So away they go again, the first period of extra time, and it's legitimate to ask to what extent mental strength will come into this. Looking forward to it. Grealish. Oh, he saved it well. Short corner routine. De Bruyne. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Good through ball. Now well, he's given us away. Can he find the right pass? De Bruyne takes on the shot. The save was a good one. Going short. Cuts it back. And a decent save. Full credit. Well, it's been all City in the last 15 minutes or so. And have got the ball into some really good positions. You just feel it's only a matter of time before they get their goal. Promising pass. And he's waiting in the centre, unaccompanied. And firing it towards goal on the volley, could have gone in. Well, that's a big chance. Yes, it's on the volley, but I think he should score there. Well, he senses a goal is coming here. It's just a case of being more clinical now. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. As you can see, this is a great bit of skill. He hits it perfectly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant strike.
What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Well, that's it for the first period of extra time. Let's see what the second has in store. Well, the big question, who will come out on top? We're into the second period of extra time here. Now, can he get on the end of this one? He's gone and found the net! Brilliant piece of finishing! Magnificent goal! Well, as the replay shows, it all started with that perfectly weighted ball over the top of the back line. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. Well, they needed that, and so did he. Just look at the manager's relief there. Neither side shy about shooting in this match. Over the byline, hence a goal kick. Vardiol Here's Grealish Mateo Kovacic And Sissi on the front foot near the end of this contest Still level here Well, nearly shaving the crossbar with that powerful effort Number 16 And easily intercepted. And a chance to whip it in here. Fernando Silva. It's a perfect challenge. A final that will live long in the memory. It's not finished yet because it's going to come down to a penalty shootout to settle the outcome. And now it is all about the penalty shootout. In it goes! Can he convert? Oh, he saved it! And he succeeds in finding the bottom corner. His turn to try to convert from the spot. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. And he finds the net, he could hardly miss. Almost intolerable pressure. And there it is! That brings it to a conclusion. And a contrast in emotions. One team joyful, the other absolutely devastated. Well, what drama, what scenes, and what a good finish to this game. It really has been exhilarating. Well, in football, you don't forget these moments in a hurry. Due reward for their persistence and their overall excellence. Well, it really has been engrossing today. Such a tight game, but you have to feel sorry for the losers. They were so close, but yet so far away. And the party mood has enveloped the stadium. It's going to be quite the night of celebration here.
Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. And the celebrations will be continuing long into the night. I think we can say that without any fear of contradiction. And it's great to celebrate with the fans. They've made so much noise here. They've got right behind their team. They certainly have. And the players greatly appreciate that. Always a joint effort on these big occasions. And now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren.